All right, let's get it back. Um, well, not let's not get anything back, but let's go back to that area. There's nothing to nothing to get back anymore. All the all the humanity is gone, but uh, at least I put the souls into good use, uh, leveling up the leveling up the pyromancy pyromancy flame. Yeah, this uh, this pile isn't much good for me. Hmm. Jumped too early. Took me surprisingly long time to uh, kind of uh, well, how do you how do you call that when you actually die die twice in a row, losing uh, losing all those souls and humanity. It was, uh, all this all this time, and you are you are stuck in the floor, glitching at me, aren't you? There we go. Shooting at me already, and it's hard to hard to see you. And now, uh, don't remember if the flies come up here. Were they just following me? Don't really remember. Oh, you shoot me, and now you hit me. One freaking dot. You fell? Are you? S what the hell was that about? Are you scared of? No, you went. Uh, took a step back. What? Are you actually dodging my miracle? That is pretty, uh, that is pretty outstanding. Yes, you are. <laughs> he can't hit me and I can't hit him. Humanity gone down there. Everything gone. Oh well. Do I want to go down there and uh, ah, there are three of those dogs. Yes, indeed. I think I do want to go collect this one. The shiny. 
Oh, hello. Should have kept using the toxin dodge. Can I shoot those dogs down there? Well, especially if I fall again. No, not that one. It's slow. Gets the job done, but it's slow. Keeper soul. All right. Well, it's time for me to man. There's a lot of you. I, I didn't remember. Didn't remember that there were so many of you. Luckily, you aren't that smart. I need to deal with you guys. Oh, yes, you on the side. Would have liked to lose my uh, lose my souls in a in a fight, not uh, oh well, not lose my souls, but lose uh, lose the collected humanity. Then instead, I lose it in a <laughs> miss miss jump on an elevator. Oh well, I don't need to go there because I collected those things already. See if I get my get my sorry ass away from here. Is there more toxic dots, guys? No. Ah, but there are those flies. Collected this key. I don't need to do it again. And now I need to fight a couple of those barbarians. Are you watching the other way or are you watching it this way? Yes, there is. Stuck. Come to this side. Do you uh, easily fall off? <laughs> I thought I had a lock on. This time I will deal it in a way that I, I won't get poisoned. Maybe, just maybe. Yeah, I, I don't know if I... If I had, 
if I had lost at this point of the game also the 100,000 souls I had and the 17 humanity, uh, I might have uh, might have actually been more uh, more enraged about that. As it was, uh, just a little inco inconvenience in case I want to go. Uh, I guess I want to go and uh, get some item drops because that's that's what the humanity mostly gives me. Uh, if possible, I will want to just bypass everything here. And the toxic dodge fellows are gone. Mr. Uh, Mr. Barbarian with a big club. Let's dance. You can roar all you want. I don't care. <laughs> right to parry. This time I did it. So why don't you stay down? No? And I will get your dung pie. Now there's two of them and that what that I don't like really. The other one was looking the other way, was it? I think so. Okay, good. Yeah, much, much better fighting you here. Uh, I don't like that hit at all. Not sure if it's, if it's even possible to parry that one. Did you? And this takes me to the gate that I opened when I used the master key. So this is the Valley of Drakes. And that way, that way is the, is the poison dragon. A little uh, zombie dragon, if you will. But I won't go there now. Next up, after visiting Filing Shrine here, I think I will go to the Dark Root Garden. do something else there as well but I will go after the moonlight butterfly the boss of that area and um, I will get the divine ember and with the divine ember I can turn my weapons into divine weapons which uh, get more powerful 
with my fate stat. Something I've been planning here uh, all along. Lordrek is gone. Oh no! What do we have here? The firekeeper is dead. I wonder if Lautrek had anything to do with it. you know anything about it? Did you ring the second bell? Yes. That is incredible, I must say. But now we have a new problem. Oh. It's noisy. It snores. And its breath is lethal. This is no laughing matter, I tell you. What are you talking about? Damn. That stench. And I was really beginning to like it here. Oh, maybe it's time I do something about it. So you're done sitting here by the fire? Oh, maybe it's time I do something about it. And speaking of the fire... The light is gone. Light is gone, how sad. Huh? Oh, hey there, Laurentius. Mm. Maybe that is the stench that the guy at the fire was talking about. How you doing? Oh, hello there. I'm pleased to see you safe. As always, if you provide the materials, I can teach you pyromancy. Well, well, now that I'm here, I might not even use these spells, but since uh, I conveniently had 4,000 souls, might as well. Thank you. Did you hear me ring the second bell? Pyromancy has a, well, rather primitive aspect to it. It messes poorly with advanced culture, and pyromancers are considered rather unsavory. Which is fine, as I never got along with anybody anyway. So, for me, turning undead didn't change a thing. <laughs> yeah, it looks, looks like you're not even listening to me. Goodbye you know. then. Come back if you find anything new. Yes, I will. Looks like uh, he's so, uh, so much into, uh, into his thoughts. Thoughts about pyromancy that doesn't even uh, doesn't even really listen to me. Now, what are you? Ah, hello. Was it you who rang the bell of awakening? Yes. I am the primordial serpent, King Seeker Frant, close friend of the great Lord Gwyn. Chosen undead, who has rung the bell of awakening, I wish to elucidate your fate. Do you seek such enlightenment? Okay. Very well. Then I am pleased to share. Chosen undead, your fate is to succeed the great Lord Gwyn, so that you may really? link the fire, cast away the dark, and undo the curse of the undead. To this end, you must visit Anor Londo and acquire the Lord Vessel. The Lord Vessel? I am pleased to see you well. Is it something urgent? Well... Can you give me anything else? 
Any other hints, tips, where to go? Those who seek the realm of lords must brave Sen's fortress, a deadly house of traps. Many have gone before you, but none have returned. Fate has chosen you, but proceed with caution. All right. Anything else? Those who seek the realm of lords so must no. brave Sen. Thank you, King Seeker. Fra what was it? Framped? Forgot already. I wonder if the fellows and the ladies here. Yes, they are. Hmm. You still don't speak. What if I got them? But I'm not sure. What about you? Oh, you yet again. You're a persistent one, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Honestly, I don't have a problem with your kind, but there's not very much that I can do. I'm Vince of Thorolan. Let's say a word for our safety. A prayer to our marvelous law, Reria Knox. You're from Thorland as well. I don't know. Maybe I knew you in the past life. A lady? Did I not explain the urgency of our tasks? You did. Or are you so uncouth as to lack such judgment? By the looks of you, I should think not. I'm sorry again, my lady. Sorry for bothering you. Alright, making my way to the Undead Parish, or through it, back to the bonfire above, Andre the Blacksmith. And from there, I can actually go to Sense Fortress, or I can go to the Dark Root Garden. And uh, because I want. Because I want the Divine Emperor, I think I will go to the Dark Root God. Before I do anything else, I will rest at this bonfire so I don't go all the way back to Blight Town. And uh, that's the way. That's the gate that opened when I rang the second bell. And, uh, I didn't visit the gates when it was locked, so I uh, I missed one uh, minor uh, one minor encounter. Nothing too important, but uh, we'll meet the fellow who was there uh, later on. But as said, I won't be going to Sense Fortress just yet. I will um, go and visit uh, Dark Root Garden. Because I don't have the souls, I don't really need to uh, talk to Andre right now. Instead, I do need to fight this guy. I think my uh, lightning spear works on it. I could go and fight it, but there will be plenty of these guys later on, so might as well take it out. My lightnings are bigger than yours. You leave me something. Ooh, Demon Titanite. Thank you very much. Ah, the forest. 
forest and the creatures. Creatures of the forest. Just checking, was there something here? No. There you come. Hello, tree. What should I say? End. Okay, so free. Free swings on you. Shouldn't be uh, too difficult. Uh, if you watched. Uh, If you watched the part 2 when I was doing the suicide run, I came from here. This is uh, Dark Root Basin. I came from uh, came from down there. Uh, got, uh, got actually uh, this very shield. There, uh, deeper here in the forest I got this armor. But this time, uh, this time I'm here to stay. I see you. Come on. one and this very door here is what I can open with the key I bought from Andre and I believe here is a good place for a certain note so let's probably place it here imminent illusory ball is there a loser wall here? Yes, indeed. Hello, Spawn Fire. Mm. Now the thing is, do I want to use my... Do I want to use my humanity? Turn into human? And uh, kindle that bonfire. Or do I want to stay in this area a bit and maybe get some humanity? Well, I think um, what I will do is um, I will use one humanity. That will give me the one. One humanity improving my uh, drop rate, and I will probably fight fight here a bit before I go to the boss. And now uh, hoping to get some, uh, hoping to get some um, humanity while at it. But yeah, this is the key. Crest of Artorias. This crest opens a door in the Dark Root Garden, sealed by ancient magic. The door leads to the grave of Sir Artorias, the Abyss Walker. Many adventurers have left for the grave, but none have returned. For they make easy prey for local bandits. With such dangers, the crest can do more harm than good in the hands of uninitiated. Since I bought it, I will, uh, I will use it. And this part of the forest is where uh, there are not only dangerous NPCs here, especially for my level, but uh, coming into this area as humans, and uh, as a human, uh, you are very likely to get invaded, because uh, the faction... Mm, 
forest hunters uh, invade this place uh, through uh, kind of uh, um, in invade with permission, I guess I could say. So uh, they kind of protect protect this part of the forest. So coming here as a human is. Uh, it's a good way to engage in PvP, I guess, or join that faction and invade others. But uh, I won't go there yet. It's also a place. There's a certain trick which I uh, I won't be using, but it's a uh, it's possible to quite easily farm souls there uh, by uh, tricking tricking the NPCs to fall off. But yeah, I won't be I won't be doing that. All right, I stepped into your ambush already when I was here before, didn't I? I got staggered. Sniper spots and uh, imminent ambush. As those guys jump off the first time one goes there. 